Hi, I'm Marlene Watson Tara, an expert in healthy living and author of Go Vegan. Through over 40 years of health and lifestyle coaching, I've dedicated myself to teaching the world the most important lesson there is, that health is everything and without health, everything is nothing. If you don't take care of your body, where are you going to live? Eight slices of bread, so easy to do. You tear them into small bite-sized pieces, pop them into your food processor, pulse. We take them out, pop them in the bowl. We put in the seasoning, just some simple sea salt, some garlic powder, and a little mixture through. Make sure you spread them out evenly because you don't want to end up with them cooking on the outside and not crisping up in the inside. So into the oven with these they go. Five minutes. I had such bad health growing up. I had my tonsils, my adenoids, my appendix and my gallbladder removed. And now here I am, 62, with key parts of my immune system and digestive system gone. Yet, I'm able to lead a fit and active lifestyle with more energy than people half my age because I eat to feed my gut, which gives me all the strength and vitality I need and I never get sick. Taking two nice large cloves of garlic, I'm going to slice them down. So just cut into your onion and then slice round, tip to the side. Well, I'm going to use some seasoning today. I've decided to have some paprika, ground coriander and a little mixture of some basil and dried oregano. So decide what you prefer to do yourself. Again, if you like a little bit of spice, add some chilli if that's what your heart desires. So this is sizzling as you can hear already. Look at this teaspoon of soil. It's got millions of microorganisms in it. And so do we, right here. They outnumber our own cells 10 to 1. They're our gut biome, and they not only help us digest our food, but directly linked to our brains. For example, serotonin, the happy drug that our brain thrives on, right? 90% of the receptors for this are in your gut. So happy gut, happy you. So get yourself a nice big bowl. Transfer your black beans into the large bowl short grain brown rice and also for me for a sort of mouthfeel taste I use silken tofu. Mash them all down. Take some salsa. So you want two good heaped tablespoons and also along with that I enjoy using what I call my favourite umami taste. This is an umami paste. Again use the ingredients um, that makes your heart sing but always make sure that you use foods that are going to make you happy. Now I'm going to add the teriyaki sauce, so about two tablespoons. That's one. And I don't really need to measure because I know what two tablespoons look like. Two tablespoons. I know what you're thinking. Marlene, can changing my diet really affect my health that much? Yes! Changing to the right diet is scientifically proven to lower blood pressure, lower cholesterol, reverse diabetes type 2 and many cancers as well. Eczema, acid reflux, IBS, Crohn's disease and colitis all can be dramatically improved with the right diet, the Go Vegan diet. And you can live longer too. Ever heard of telomeres? They're the bits of chromosomes that control how long we live. And if you follow the Go Vegan lifestyle, you can increase the enzyme that feeds and lengthens them by almost 30% in just three months. Well, the sorted vegetables are ready, so we can switch them off. And I'm going to add this mixture. And then I'm going to add in the herbs and spices. Now, I've used some paprika and ground coriander and some mixed herb seasoning. I like citrus in burgers too. You may think that's a strange combination, but what I'm trying to do is to get all the robust flavours, the sweet, the sour, the salty, the bitter, the pungent, and just get them all singing and dancing in your taste buds. In Go Vegan, I'll show you it's easy to adopt a healthy vegan way of eating. It's full of delicious recipes for all tastes, from quick meals for one, 
to show-stopping dinner parties. Busy life? No problem. Go Vegan is packed with quick meals for busy people where you cook once and eat twice or three times. Let the kitchen work for you. So I'm going to mince some coriander. Take the top of your hand, gather your greens in, ready to go. Waste not, want not, as I say. Bring your bowl back. Give this one mix round. Now we're going to add in our breadcrumbs. We're going to start rolling these now. So take a good heaped tablespoon. And the secret to making a good burger that doesn't fall apart is you really pat it back and forward to your hand. So you're taking the air out and then simply making it into a patty shape. Make sure you don't have any little parts of the coriander coming out the edges. So you want to make a really nice burger shape. And that goes straight onto your tray. So these are going to be baked in the oven. 20 minutes, 15, 20 minutes, um, usually turning them over halfway through. And sometimes I give an extra three or four minutes as well. Diet means deprivation, but with Go Vegan, there's no counting calories or craving food because nothing is taken away, just replaced with a healthier alternative. So whatever your heart desires, my book will help you make it with grains and beans, vegetables, fruits, nuts and seeds, and you will adore it. There's no worries about getting what you need either. The first thing someone will say to you is, oh, veganism, tried it. Where do you get your protein? Have you ever heard the phrase, strong as an ox? Where does the ox get his protein from? The same place as you will with Go Vegan, from plants grown in the soil. So the burgers are ready. I'm going to take them from the oven. They smell delicious. And I'm going to make myself a wonderful burger. I take myself a nice bun. Cut through the top. I'm going to fill it with all my favorite things my vegan mayonnaise. Delicious creamy. Then I'll put on a layer of sprouts. This gives it a nice kick. These radish sprouts or whatever sprouts you're making yourself or the ones you can buy in the supermarket gives a nice crunch. Some red onion. Pop on a burger. Some relish. And I adore pickles. I'm just going to slice through very thinly. And it just adds a lovely tartness to the whole experience of burger in a bun. And a few pieces of nice lettuce on the top. Tiny little bit more mayonnaise because it's my absolute favorite. And then you're going to top that with your topping of your bun. Another little piece of pickle. Pop in a little stick. And hey presto, a delicious feast, not only for the eyes, but for the tummy. So I'm going to sit and have a cup of tea and enjoy. My book, This Gorgeous Food, The Healthier, Happier Way of Life You Will Discover is what gets me up out of bed every morning. Imagine the impact it would have if everyone went vegan. How can we have a healthy world with so many sick people? We have to have healthy humans to be able to get our planet back on track. So join me, start a revolution and go vegan!